Hello there, welcome back to some more Mario and Luigi Dream Team Bros. I've got this bad boy. Um, it's a Switch Pro controller I'm using to actually control the game now, and that's to solve the tilt problems I was having. In fact, if I show you, I cut out about 15 minutes of me messing with this shit um, last time. It wasn't me messing with it in a good way though, because I was trying to use the mouse. Now if I show you what I actually am going to do when I try and tilt, hold the controller up like this. Using Bluetooth. There we go. So yeah, sorry, I had a few uh, difficulties for a second. The way I do the gyro has got to be kind of specific. Um, but yeah, I can show you, I can do it twice in a row, no problem now. Turn the gyro a little bit to the left and the right. And I've got much more control. There's no curse on the screen. Easy peasy. Bosh, bosh, bosh. So yeah, the way I do it is important. Okay, cool. And now I can use a controller for all controller-based things. Including menuing and jumping around and pressing R and all that stuff. Okay, let's keep going. Sorry about that, that's weird. Of course I tried to show you and immediately I tried to show you it starts freaking out, but that's because of the way I did it. It's my fault. We're going to Dreams Deep and it's hot as balls. So I'm only going to do one video. But I just wanted to test the control to make sure it's working. Hmm? What's this? What's wrong, Luigi? Mario, what's taking you so long? You're freaking me out. Mario! Mario, everything okay in there? Uh... I wonder if you made it to the bottom of the dream world. Contact! Found him! Ha! Napping, are we? My, how comfy! Hey, it's you guys, why are you here? Excuse me, he's up on the altitude, huh? Are you implying we shouldn't be here? Oh, why, did you get an invite to this island too? Somehow I doubt it, I bet you heard about it. Yeah, I bet you just invited yourselves. Affirmative. We got intel about an interesting little island, so we escorted Lord Bowser straight away. Any complaints about it should be lodged with our elite fists. Elite? I know! Bowser promoted all three of us! We're his elite personal guard! I'm not feeling much eliteness. Enough blabbering! His grouchiness approaches even as we speak! These horns gleam with fury as our spikes sparkle with malice! Any second now, his time meanless comes! Bowser! What do you want? Give it to me straight. Princess Peach is gone. Hello? That is my thing. Only I get to kidnap her. Treason! You heard that rumor and came here to find her? Sorry, Mario escorted her back to safety. So, you're out of luck. I have a nap on the beach. Ah. I hate Peach as much as I hate your voice. But I don't have time to deal with you now. See, kidnapping and Princess Peach is my calling in life. I don't care what you did. I'll find her and nab her. Huh? What's that stupid warpy thing? No, back, stay away! <laughs> that warpy thing smells like her perfume. Oh yeah, she's in there, I'm sure of it. Nah. You think I'll let Mario fight her for me? Oh dear. Here I am. In the deepest of the dreams. We avoid our dreams deep. I feel like I've been here before. Where's Dreamy Luigi? Hello? I sense he's lost his way. He's but a thread in the fabric of the dream world. I'm certain he'll return. We need to focus on rescuing Peach. Big bro! Hmm? Thank <laughs> you. 
Yes. Let me help, big bro. I'm not gonna see big bro stylish. Take me with you. Big bro, where's Peach? Big bro, please take me with you. Hey, nobody mess with my bro. Big bro, I can help. Ah, all is illuminated. It's the deepest reach of Luigi's dreams. Luigi's emotions are swelling around here. In a sense, this place is Jimmy Luigi himself. Ooh. Yeah? Jimmy Luigi we know may be here as well. But there's no use in looking for him. Let's forge ahead. Mm -hmm. Go rightwards. I wanna go too! My bro is the best! Big bro, big bro, big bro rocks. Big bro, big bro, my bro is the best. Uh, I know what I need to do real quick. There we go. Must be the only one I didn't do. Don't leave me! Big bro! Big bro! Wait for me, big bro! Hello. It's probably dangerous ahead. You may not be able to come back. You can leave if you jump towards that light. I don't know what's up ahead. Help me! Big bro, it's your choice. I will never. Luigi will follow you. We're all here for you, bro. Always. Big bro, big bro! Whee! Oh, wait. Big bro, let's go! Okay. Hi, Dreamy Luigi. Are you Dreamy Luigi? Yes. No, no. This place is getting to my head. Mario, Dreamy Luigi, we need to keep going. Peach must be up ahead. Cool. Let's do that. My hands don't tend to cramp as much when I'm using a good controller, which is much better for my hands in general. Okay, let's keep going. Hello. Mario! No, no, it, it is true. And Tasma. Incoming! Hello. So what's the deal here, you Peach's kidnapper? <laughs> You're just a little baby bat. I could wear you as a brooch or something. Bam. Seriously, that was it? What a total win. Mario, we need to get out of here. Let's return to the real world. Whoa, good plan, Toots. Time to fight, Mario. It's my turn to kidnap her. It's kidnapping Peach. It's kidnapping Peach. Two. Oh, it's kidnapping Peach 2, the Bowsering. Time to lose. What's that? What is on me? No, you mustn't, Antasma. <laughs> Get off me, right down. We go now, screech back to the real world. Stop it! Get off! Squeak, I wanted to steal Peach's power, but I changed my mind. You are much stronger and evil, Skrionk. Walk with me, Skrip. Ugh. Say it, don't spray it, dingbat. I don't work with anyone. Get real. End this at once. 
Skrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
but they're white. Washed him. Suit of Jaw and a suit of Jaw. They clearly want me to use less power. Oh, right, here we go. Now, I will dodge the flames of power. I get longer than I think to react to the flames as well. It was going to be vaguely in the middle. Because if you're in the middle, it's easy to go to either side. Good, 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 good. Up a little bit and go for the old uh, Bowser special. He's dead. Squeak! Iron Ball Hammer. Not quite a level up for the Weege, but we're getting there. Oh, yeah. Oh, we can get four attack again. Okay, we'll try. Nice. Beautiful. Your senses, waste them. Oh, no. Oh. Well, how does it feel to be all powerful? Screak! <laughs> oh, yeah. I could get used to this. You got yourself a deal. Screech, we fly to the field world. My dark plan unfolds. Why, <laughs> Hold it, guy. I came here to kidnap Peach, remember? He can take the girl anytime, but we must stick to the plan for now. Ugh, fine. Mario, I'll be back for Peach. Don't let anyone else kidnap her until I get back. Come on, Screech! They'll mock your propulsion. Hello? Yeah! Hmm. An interesting situation indeed. Huh? Ah, that must be Princess Peach. These boys managed to save you, did they? Clearly at some cost, for they all sleep now. It's dangerous to fall asleep in a dream. Well, I have little choice. I will take you to the real world. Uh, the Bowser and that bat. No. <laughs> hey, ugly, learn to fly. Yes, yes, yes. Squeak, hee hee hee. Free, squeak. I've returned. <laughs> Ooh, look who made a powerful buddy. That's right, me. Now I'm unstoppable. <laughs> They say Anthony Bowser's voice too much because that hurts my throat. I mean, that was Bowser, right? Princess Peach! Oh, thank goodness. Hello. Seems our travel went well, correct? Looks like all are safe and sound. I'm sorry for making everyone worry. I'm fine, thank you. We better tell Toadsworth too. My friends, we haven't the time for niceties. Evil is upon us, Antasma. Antasma has returned. Impossible, my prince. Are you absolutely sure? Antasma? The very same. He who was imprisoned in the dream world. The evil king of bats. 
he was returned to plague us once more. As I said before, the evil bat king Antasma wanted to fulfill his wishes. He stole the Dark Stone, but my people imprisoned him. Just before he was banished, Antasma crushed the Dark Stone. And then we were all imprisoned in darkness, right? Yeah. The falling chunks of nightmare turned us all into stone. But we succeeded in imprisoning Antasma in the dream world. Even so, we knew he would live on within the dream world. We knew he would be waiting for his bonds to weaken. And when they did, he would have his chance to return. Not only that, but he's teamed up with Bowser. He will again try to conquer our world and sow the nightmare. Hmm. Ah. If that's the case, Antasma will surely go after the Dreamstone. The Dreamstone? You can grant any wish and it's on this island, right? We must leave this area and make it for the nearby desert. The stone is in dozing sands. Mario. Hello. Luigi. Please, I beg of you, stop Antasma and Bowser. If two such evil beings were to get the Dreamstone, the world would be in utter peril. Whatever it takes, you have to prevent that from happening. Please, it's up to you to stop Antasma and Bowser. Okay. Okay. Whatever. I'm doing it for the experience. You know how it is. Bahu. Hey. I'll make sure this gate stays open from now on, okay? I'm heading back, Redwoods. Swing by sometime, yeah? I'm from New York. Okay, Princess Peach, I think it'll be safe for you back at the castle. Mario Luigi, good luck, I'll leave this to you. We should be going too. Hold on a moment. L Dream, is there anything amiss? Oh no, there's no crisis, my prince. I just wanted to tell my fellow beard enthusiasts something. Eh? Yes? If we stand true and bring more aid to the Pilo folk, I hope you will come to see me on occasion. As a Pilo elder, I have gifts I would bequeath to those worthy. Well spoken, Eldream, you do our people proud. Eldream speaks truly and know that I will add some gifts of my own. As you travel, I hope you will continue to help any Pilo folk you find. If such strength within you, use it to help the Sleeping Stones. Yes, well, this Pilo is going to have a nice nap in the Administrator's hut. Oh, I forgot, so far you've helped a total of six Pilos. I suppose that merits some small award. You got a bear hammer. If you can free a total of seven Pilos, I should give you something else. Of course. Everybody set, let's go find that dream stone. The dozing sands are just beyond this park exit. The bad guys might have already found it. Hurry! I'm not going that way. No, no. Alright. We've got an iron ball hammer. Occasionally drops an iron ball. Yes. It increases your striking power if you have nowhere equipped, which I don't. So in exchange for less uh, defense, I have even more attack, which is good, that's what I want. Okay, so I can't go this way still, but I can go up here now. Having this actual angularly movement again is quite nice. See you in a minute. I did it. Now I got used to get, got to get used to the way the controller feels compared to normal keyboard. It won't take that long to get back used to it. I only say it because I got like an okay, and I was like, "What? What do you mean just okay? You insane?" Now I can go this way. You see. That's where I want to be. Give me forever to do that. It's kind of nice. Still can't make it up there though. And I can't go around there because that's a backwards. That's a backwards. To get up there I can go there, but I can also kill this flip bee. Bonk. Do it. Yay. Welcome, Weege. Yeah. To level 10.
can get three. You can get three. You can get four. You can get four. You can get three. Okay, let's try and get four health. I guess. Beautiful. Oh yeah. That's what we like. Okay. Now this is not difficult. Set the blues up how you want it. That's not how I want it. I think it can reset it by hitting it again, maybe? Yeah. I can get off them and fix it. Okay. That's what I want. Beautiful. Okay. Here. Is the bridge still broken or can I get home now? It might still be broke. And because of um, using a controller, I can use more than three inputs at once. He's broken. No joy. Not yet, anyway. I can't seem to buy any badges yet because I'm purely out of luck on that front. But I might be able to find a new shop that has badges, so I won't worry about it too much yet. Let's go down here. Where the game wanted me to go to begin with. Dozing sands to the right. Hello. Welcome to potential customer. Allow me to give you a quick tour of my shop. Where gloves and accessories, all your defensive needs. I like defensive. Boost the chance of a gift. Increase the amount of badge fills up. 20 more coins. Negates damage three times over the course of a fight. Guard badge could be good if I feel myself getting hurt a lot. But for now, it's going to heal up. I've got 1800 coins and my gear is fine. Don't even worry about it. Right, dozing sands. Off we go. Hello. This here, this is where the dozing sense the birds under construction is what you step. Capiche, don't say I didn't warn you, you have to twist your ankle or something. Please die. Right, new enemies for me. The green lad and the red lad. The colours of them dictate what where they're gonna go. The flounderflage. So both of them are red now. And you can tell if you hit them, but often you can't hit them. That's a nice uh, hit straight away. No hit a 10. Cool. An 87 XP. Oh, baby. I think I actually lied. When I said I got to the like, start of World 3, I actually got to the start of World 4. Is the truth. I forgot this was a thing. I didn't think about it before I did it, but yeah, so they can do the weird normal slide, which is fine, or they can do the weird shit. And if they do the weird shit, I've got to be careful. And now I've got to fight this guy and see what he does. Hello. Yeah, so the, uh, the way that eyes point is where they're going to go. The sand dune. Makes sense, his name is sand dune. Looks like a sand dune. 
Okay, so far so good. That was a bit early, but I got away with it. No hit 11. Nice. And 72 XP. Okay. That's already gone. It's not though. I can always leave and get more HP if I need it. Who is a bad shop? Hey, you two! Oh boy, I tell you fellas, today's your lucky day. I'm selling the best badges this side of Mount Pajama Maja. A pajama -ja. Yeah, using a badge can really make or break a battle, so what do you say? You already got a pair. I'm not seeing a lot of variety though, that's a real shame. You seem like a nice couple of guys, so I'll tell you what. Oh. I'll cut you a deal, because a thousand coins for a new pair of badges. Mm. Playing hard, will I? Okay, how about 500 oh. coins? You really twisted my arm here. 200 mm. coins. 100 coins. Fun oh. offer. 80 coins? Mm. 50. Oh. 30. Mm. 10. 5. Mm. Fine, one coin. Oh. Going once. Going twice. Oh, what the heck? It's on the house. I really gotta work on my hagging skills. Here you go. You got new badges. You can equip badges from the menu screen. Wanna know how to use badges? No. You sure you might learn something? I'm good. Well, I guess that means you already know you can equip badges via the menu and that you should try changing badges whenever you get a new one and that you should try equipping different badges for different effects. I get new badges in from time to time. You should stop by every now and then. Okay. Hey, look who it is. Come to look at my badges, eh? I have. I'm going to buy the silver badge straight away because it's 1500 money and that makes it good. I'll sell one of everything I've got two of. Look in the badges menu then. So, in our badges menu, if I get the guard badge, I form a barrier that reduces damage to zero for three attacks. If I use the bronze badge, I can get 30% of each person's BP. I can get 50% BP. the mushroom and the silver. Um, for now, I'd rather just have that, but if I get the master's badge too, can I see which way they go? Yeah, I can. I can. I'll get a virus badge. I'm going to have to buy all the badges at some point anyway. It's just who I am. I can't help it. But let's see what the virus badge does. Temporarily decreases enemies' power, make them do less damage. Remove stats, all stats effects from all enemies. Might turn any foe into a mushroom of a type, depending on their coin count. But now I'm going to stick with giving me health. It's a defensive option, it's boring, but it works. You know? Let's do this. I've ruined both my excellent and my missing chance because I'm an idiot. And forgot that I didn't already have my excellent. So I was trying to do the cheat or the, the trick where I can do a shit attack and just try and get excellent uh, dodges. But I messed it up. I messed it up, okay? I'm sorry. We're already getting back on track for both, though. to see all different enemy types bow before me. Don't worry about those X's in the ground, they aren't important. They don't definitely won't be relevant soon. No oh man oh man oh man I fell down the sand flow. 
Bah, you're in for it now. Buddha's gonna have you your shell for this. No, I've got to get back up there. You can't. There's no way to climb up that sand flow unless you had a scaffold, which you don't. <laughs> and then when Buddha finds out, Ooh. there's just no way to climb up that sand flow. If only I had some magic stairs or something. Magic stairs, you say? Days of the sand flow accident one. Report sand mishaps or you're fired. Stay still. Whoa! Stay still! Oh, they're trying to help. Ah, I didn't press hammer in time. It's going swimmingly. Come here, you sand dune. There we go, I got excellent 10. Now I just need to get dodge 10. Forever. Hey. Oh, there's an attack piece down here, so I'm gonna go get it. Well, I can't get it yet, but I can get it soon. Yes. I think if you get hit by that upward attack, it will count as an attack. Okay. And there's dodge 10. 5. So we're, we're getting there now. I'll get more to a grips with the combat yet. Hello. Yeah. Alright, lads. Nice. Welcome to level 11, Mario. Ooh, 50 attack. So now I've turned a little bit again. I can get a 4 in HP though. So that's what I'll probably do. That's the second four. Don't like getting the second four, I like getting the first four, but it's okay. More health is more good. Thanks for the hand, guys. Hey, uh, I noticed you guys have hammers. Oh, yeah. Let's hook them up. You really helped us out, so in return, we'll show you a special technique. Eddie, I saw this in a movie once. Whoa, it worked. You can hit the red guy with your hammer to send him underground, and if that isn't cool enough, you can just move underground. You can go in defences and other objects with this technique. Why don't you give it a shot? It doesn't hurt very much. Just press the R button to change the action to a hammer. Then press B to give him a whack with the hammer. Solid whack, green man. Red guy, you can move around the circle pad. Just hit the A button to pop back out. You learned a technique. You learned the Mole Mario Bros move. Press the R button to change the hammer. Action icon to the hammer, press the B button. It's much easier to do on a controller than it is on a keyboard. But before I forget, there's one more thing you can do with that hammer. You just do the same thing as before, but on a hard surface. Check it, instead of going underground, you get squashed like this. You could probably use this technique to go through small holes. Just smack him with the hammer again to return him to more size. It's your turn now, put it back into it. Yep, you're on a hard surface where you can't go underground. Now press the R button, switch the action to the hammer. Press the B button, swing the hammer. That's it, good work. Now press the B button to rack him back to normal. You know, the small Mario Bros move. Mario shrinks for hitting with a hammer on a hard surface. What is it? We test the new moves you just learned. Go hit that block over there. And while you're at it, hit that one over there too. We excavate those blocks earlier today, you can have them. Really, we insist you have to start to surround them. Of course, she's standing on the fucking bean. You little shit. Wah wah. There we go. There's one more over here. Need to go all the way out for this one. Pop that pillow down. Come useful later. There we go. Oh yeah, nice block busting. Let's wrap up this uh, this thing up. Bring it in, you two. Alright. Okay, one last thing. Go underground and come back up when you're underneath this bean hole. In case you didn't see the giant X. 
heart bean. Yep, that's a bean, alright. Take it from me, beans are where it's at, they increase your stats. Sure, one bean won't make that much big of a difference, but they really add up. Before you know it, you'll be a powerhouse. People say you can find bean holes all over the island, so every time you see one, get your bean on. Check collection in the menu to see the beans you found. This will be really ha this will really come in handy, so don't forget. Alright, and with that, I'll see you guys next time when we go and explore what this pillow has to offer and then go get that puzzle piece. It's all good. See you then. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.